Joe Rogan isn't pleased with what happened to Kanye West. He claims that's not the right way of doing things. You can't just cancel someone because they have a different opinion from yours. What's funny is that none of the people at the forefront who are calling Kanye West names have said that he's telling lies. Which got me thinking that they clearly knew he was telling the truth, except that it was the truth that hurt them. Kanye West wasn't going to be cancelled or called names if he was saying things that fit their narrative. It's now more satisfying to see that many people are waking up. People are now able to speak. People are now not scared to voice their opinion about things affecting them. Joe Rogan challenges those who are disturbing Kanye West to challenge the man with facts and not cancelling him. Let them do it the way Lex Friedman did, he clearly told Kanye to have the courage to call out the individuals. Unlike calling them Jews, call them by their name and start a war against those individuals. Joe Rogan suggests that the powerful people running the world should have a conversation with Kanye and correct all the things that he's saying that they think are wrong. Of which I disagree with the part in which he says they should correct him. No one needs to be corrected. Kanye West is right in his own way. In the world we live in today, we want to erase people if we don't agree with them. And then the problem with that is that it scares people into communicating freely because they're worried they're going to be erased next, so they'll conform. I hope this Kanye West situation is the last one. We don't need people to be silent out of fear of being cancelled when they speak about what's affecting them. We all see things differently, so it's unfair that we should all be seeing things from their perspective. Kanye West isn't crazy. They are ridiculing him that way so people won't take him seriously.